Well, it's a beautiful uh, morning, mid-September, um, and we're very much into autumn now. And I thought I'd just come down here and have a look at the berries that are showing on the hedgerows, because it's that time of year when all the kind of berries are ripening. Um, and they're quite spectacular. I, mean, I don't know how well you'll be able to pick this up on the video, but uh, lovely colours here. You can hear the birds singing up there. Here we have, we've got some dog rose hips. And you can see there, lovely red colour there. Sort of orangey red. These, these are what school kids use as itching powder. I don't know how well I can break this open. Oh, just use my teeth, but um, whether you can pick up on that, but in, in inside are the little, didn't focus very well, I'm afraid, are little furry seeds. And if you put those down someone's back, they're like itching powder. So, that, so that's the dog rose hips. I used to use them in the war as well for, um, for things like syrup when they were short of vitamin C. And we're gonna come on round, a bit further round the hedgerow. Lovely blue color on here, bluey purple. Now well we can see this. I'm gonna pick a few of these. There we go, these are slows. We saw the blossom in the spring. And people use these for slow gin. And what you do is you, if you pick these, put them in the freezer overnight so they burst open a bit. And then put them in a bottle of gin with a bit of sugar. Here we go, yeah, that's what they're like. Then that produces the flavour from the slows goes into the gin. And by Christmas time it's a nice drink. You can look it up on the internet. Um, if you, they look a bit like grapes, but if you pick one of these, they're really sour. Ugh. There we go. That's quite sour, but that gives it a lot of flavour to a, a bottle of gin. So here we go. So we've got the slows there. Coming through, there we go. All the um, rose hips. Very colourful, very nice. And the important thing about things like hedge trimming is that you don't... Um, trim these till next February time, uh, like the hedgerows that is, because this is the feed for the birds for the winter. So you can see the importance of just managing the landscape for um, conservation, because this is basically what keeps the birds going for the winter.